Hey, hey, what's going on, guys? How you doing? Hope you're doing great. Maybe even Awesome Possum, perhaps. <laughs> Welcome back to Kingdom 2 Crowns. This is Episode 5 of Skull Island. Alright, so we just uh, survived a normal Blood Moon on the previous episode, right at the end. So on this one, as I said at the end of the uh, previous episode, I'm going to attack yet another portal. I think I'm going to attack the one on the left side. That sounds like the best option to me, because I would like to get a position over there. Oh, wait. Oh, I can't attack that one yet, because I don't have a knight yet. There we go. Now we got a knight. Well, I mean, I have one knight, but uh, I don't want to attack a portal with only one squad. Two squads of knights would be so much better. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh-oh. Okay, there we go. I was like, ooh, things, things look scary. All right, let's get some money back. Looks like they didn't break any of the walls, which is good. And I'll go ahead and leave another coin over here, as I usually do, for the uh, the hobo to pick up once he decides to poke his little lazy head out of that, uh, that little tent he's got set up. Alright, we need to purchase an upgrade for this knight. He's right here, so hopefully he can he can get that super quickly. There you go, laddie. Give him a boost with all those coins. Alright, let's get a, let's get some coins from our banker. Alright, cool. Where's that guy going? Where do you think you're going? The fudge? Oh, oh, he's going to meet up with that guy. That's cool. I guess they just want to be buddies, you know? Are there, even, are, are there gonna be any enemies tonight? Probably not. Because I just had a blood moon? Alright, so you know what? Let's get ahead of the game here. I want to send these guys out. Come on, knights! Why are you being so dumb? Get your butts over here. Oh my god, what are they doing back there? Why are they back there like that? Huh. It's not letting me send them out either, which I would like to do ASAP. Alright, just gonna put one coin there in case a guy decides to spawn. Come on, 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 come on. <laughs> I want to attack these fools. All right, day 32, guys, day 32. Come on, little guys. Come on, pick up the pace. I got stuff to do. People to see, places to be. All right, cool. Those guys are going out. I want to make sure I have tons of barrels, tons of fire barrels. Because who knows, this retaliation wave could be, could be pretty brutal. I'm not really sure. Nice. Got some money from the crops. Beautiful. Looks like we got some fire barrels already set up and ready to go. So this should be no problem, at, like, whatsoever, I would imagine. You guys got some money for me? Got that bunny money? Nope. Alright, that's fine. That's cool. 
That's all right. That is a okay, baby. They should. Okay, there we go. I was about to say they, they should. They should have that portal any minute now. All right, portal destroyed. Where are these guys going? Why do they keep retreating back to the uh, the second wall? Huh. I don't know. I don't get it. It's weird. I don't like it because I kind of need them up here to protect my guys. <laughs> but all right, whatever. <laughs> You want to be useless back there? That's cool, I guess. Not really. Not really. That worker's being a total badass just uh, hanging out in front of the wall. He don't even care, man. Alright, we have a pikeman over here. So he will definitely help protect us quite a bit. Alright, bring it on. I'm ready. The question is, are they going to come from both sides or only the, only the side that I destroyed the portal on? I don't really remember. Don't really remember. I don't see anybody over here yet. There's one guy. Alright, there's the first fire barrel. Guess there's no ogres? I mean, that's cool with me. I'm not complaining. Alright, let's go see what the damage is over here. Day 33! Oh, thank you much. Oh, they didn't even do any damage right on. That was easy. I guess the retaliation waves are nothing to worry about. Bunch of sissies, really. Alright, time to start chopping down some trees get this portal up and running. This is going to save me so much time. It's going to be amazing. Okay, the portal's right there. Oh, crap. <laughs> Welcome to the team, my man. Beautiful. Now let's get this set up somewhere. Alrighty. Yeah, that is going to save me a buttload of time. It's going to be amazing. Okay, you know what? I'm thinking I might even try to destroy another portal in this episode. I mean, as long as I... Oh, uh-oh. The colors of the leaves are changing. It looks like fall is uh starting to creep up on us. But yeah, I was saying... um, What was I saying? <laughs> oh yeah, I was, I was saying uh, as long as I have plenty of explosive fire barrels ready to rock and roll, I should be okay. 
So you know what? I wish I would have put that portal closer to my, uh, my castle. I should have put it, like, right here. Oh, well. <laughs> it is what it is. All right, so, uh... Go ahead and use that. Oh, thank you very much. Yeah, why are these guys hanging out back here? What the heck is going on? Just has that? That hasn't always been a thing, has it? What the heck? Alright, let's get four fire barrels set up right now. And once daytime comes around, we'll send out the guys on the right side. To go attack another portal, and then uh, we'll get more fire barrels over there as well. And we should be good to rock and roll. Yeah, what the heck are they doing back there? That's so dumb. That is so weird. I don't understand that. Is it because there's pikemen? I have no idea. I don't like it though, it's taking a lot of my defenses and putting them where they're absolutely useless. Alright, day 34. Come on fellas, get up here. Get on up here boys. Gotta send you out to war. You gotta fight for your country. For your kingdom, for your king. In this case, for your queen, but uh... That's because I didn't have a choice in the, in the say of my gender. <laughs> Jeez, why are they back there? This is actually screwing me pretty hard. What the heck, dude? Any day now. Any day now. I would like to advance the game here. Fellas got any money? A little bit. You know, I might get some from my banker just so I'm prepared for this uh, retaliation wave. Just so I can buy an extra amount of fire barrels, you know? Beautiful. But yeah, the, uh, the knights that are retreating back behind that secondary wall, that's actually screwing me up uh, pretty big, pretty big time. Not a fan. Don't know why it's doing that, but I'm not a fan. Okay, they got another portal. Let's get ourselves back over to the right side. Maybe buy a couple more fire barrels, just to be extra prepared. Oh boy. Yeah, what the heck, guys? <laughs> you flipping cowards. That is so weird. I know that the pikemen normally do that. Like if you have if you have multiple pikemen on the same side, one of them will be in front of your main wall and then one will go behind your secondary wall. So I wonder if like that is somehow glitching out the knights? I have no idea. So weird. Hmm. If that keeps happening throughout this entire game, I ugh, I might lose. <laughs> Because that's like the whole point of having knights. It's so that if they break through the wall, then they'll just run against their shields, you know, and it'll kind of act like a temporary wall. Not to mention their 
They're hogging up like 10 archers back there, not doing anything. Not good, not good. All right, bring it on, baby, I'm ready. I am ready. Ready Freddy like spaghetti. The first fire barrel has been launched. The second one. The third volley is flown. Day 35. That wasn't it, right? That was probably just a normal night. I don't know. Is it actually daytime? Or is it nighttime? Hmm. Oh, now you cowards want to come up here? That's fine. That's cool, I guess. <laughs> Oops. All right, these guys need some uh, need some bows. They need some bows, man. The bros need the bows. No, I don't want that, man. You hold on to it. I appreciate it, though. It's a kind of gesture. All right, uh, once I have the opportunity, I should advance to right here. That'd be a good spot. That'd be a great spot. I think I'll wait until the next day in order to do that. Man, those fire barrels are expensive, but they are totally worth it. Ooh, lots of money, baby. Lots of that money. Alright, you know what? I think I'm just gonna hang out over here for a little while, just so I can get a, uh, an early start on those walls. Man, I, I really love the color of the trees during fall, during autumn. Looks good, man. All right, if we advance right here, that should leave us a little bit of space for some for some rabbits, for some of that bunny money. Not too worried about it. All right, let's just chill for a little bit. Uh oh, too much money. Yupsie. Yupsie. Alright, here they come. <laughs> okay, that was a. <laughs> That, uh, that worker should be embarrassed about that shot. That was just, that was terrible. Alright, cool. Let's get an early start on this wall. And let's get the tower going as well. I guess if I wanted to, I could do two towers. Lord of the Rings, the two towers. And, uh, yeah, that'd be cool. That'd be cool. Day 36. Thank you. Thank you, lad. Much, much appreciated. Much obliged.
You know what? I feel like I'm doing good. I'm feeling pretty confident about this. I think I'm going to put a fully upgraded archer tower right here as well. And I should have enough daylight left in order to upgrade this to a tier 2 stone tower. See if we can do it one more time before nightfall. It's gonna be close. All right, the army's moving up, beautiful. Let's go recruit some more hobos. Welcome, lad. All right, they're moving the catapult up, beautiful. Pikemen are doing their work, getting some uh, some fish for me, some fish money. Looks like this guy needs a bow. Let's just fill, let's just fill up the rack. Might as well. Bows are ultra important. Oh crap! You know what I haven't done in a long time? I have not uh, filled up that hourglass statue in quite a while. I should probably go do that. <laughs> Sooner rather than later. See, now, now the knights are standing up here. What's up with that? Huh. I guess they're feeling brave today or something. I don't know. Weird. Yeah, so what do you say after night passes, I go over and fill up that hourglass shrine a little bit? And by a little bit, I mean all the way. <laughs> Jeez, that was a pitiful first catapult shot. Just embarrassing, actually. Alright, cool. And his head on over. And you know, let's get this built. And you know what? Let's start chopping down some more of the forest, shall we? Start advancing a little bit. Day 37. Day 37 in the kingdom of heaven. Oh yeah, geez. I need some cash money in this bad boy. All right. Glorious. Well, come on, Jim. Where's the money, dude? Armor Jim's letting me down. Letting me down. There we go. Uh, I feel like I don't have enough. Oh, the perfect amount. Beautiful. It was good. It was great. Right, that other portal's right there. I could clear out some more of these trees, actually. Ooh, nice shot, lad. Nice shot. Go check out the farm and see if they got any money for me. Go steal that coin, you jerk! That was just rude. I 
nice. You want a pike that bad? There you go. <laughs> he really wanted it. All right, once uh, once the next day rolls around, we're going to be upgrading this archer tower all the way, baby. Did someone just drop some money in the river? I don't like it. Boom, that was an excellent first shot. That's what I'm talking about. All right, beautiful, baby. You know what? Let's go ahead and actually chop down a few more trees. Get that rocking and rolling. Make sure I'm recruiting guys every single day. It is super mega important. Alright, day 38. Feeling great. I could do even more than that. Do it. Let's clear it out, man. Oh yeah, pikeman making me money. Dang, he just got two fish in the in the. He got three fish in the exact same spot. Is he going to get a fourth? Nah. <laughs> that was cool. Alright, I should have enough daylight left in order to upgrade this archer tower all the way. At least that's the hope. All right, rock and roll. Farmer John, thank you very much. Getting that deer money, baby. Farmer Jim, my man. These guys probably got a lot for me. Oh, yeah. Alright, guys. We're nearing the end of the episode. I think in the next episode, I'm going to start chopping down even more of the forest on this side of the island. 
And then maybe even go and take out another portal. We'll see. I may want to be a little careful about my defenses, though. I'm not sure. Because the retaliation waves are probably going to keep getting even crazier. What I need to do is, I need to find... That is a pitiful shot. <laughs> I need to find, uh... <laughs> I need to find, uh, another hobo camp so I can recruit even more guys. Too much money. Jeez Louise, that is nuts. Alright, actually... Let's go head back home to the castle, that is, and give some money to the banker, because geez louise, this is a lot. Alright guys, day 39, feeling fine. <laughs> and with the new day, guys, we're going to go ahead and call that the end to yet another episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. As always, if you did, a thumbs up and subscription would be absolutely splendid. And I will see you fine folks in the next one.